Hey, birthday girl. Don't. Anna. Hey. What's wrong? I mean, I know this is this is weird, but. <laughs> How are you doing? Not, not okay. <laughs> oh, I know. Sorry. This is so weird. I know. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I'm really happy for you, but it's um, it's just a lot. <laughs> How is that? How was when you came the first night? Mansion. Terrible. Honestly, like I had no idea what what you were gonna say or a little bit of me was kinda hoping that you weren't just dropping something off, but that you were coming in and but I didn't need that and I like appreciated you bringing the the wings back and you didn't have to do that. I gave those to you and like, no matter what, you are always going to mean so much to me. Like, no matter what. No matter how ridiculously emotional I look leaving that island of Crete and cry my eyes out, that was insane, but... Um, that was... It was I'm rough. Sorry. Nah. You followed your heart, and... I no, can't... No. My heart was that. very confused. I don't know what I did. I don't know. I don't know what the I was doing. I don't know. I'm really up. I question what I should have done, and you know, I question a lot. This is so insane. What would you say if I, I asked you to come? part of the house. I mean, maybe. Like, oh my gosh. Do you regret sending me home at all in Crete? Yeah, Peter, I question it all the time. I'm, I'm so confused right now, because I'm, I know I shouldn't feel that way, but I, like, I did kind of want you to come back in. Like, I remember I saw you that first night, and I remember saying, like, wow. Didn't even notice you, I swear to God. And then you come out, and then I realized who it was. And, like, I just, I don't know what to do right now. I'm so confused. And this is the, the first week that this whole thing has started. And I'm obviously not 100% where I thought I was. I don't know what to do. I can't help how my heart feels. I look at her and I just don't want to stop looking at her. And I want to just kiss her and just, just like have had all this work out. And it didn't, and I know it didn't. And I just, I feel like such a jerk because I have such an awesome group of girls here expecting to meet someone that was truly ready to have this work for them as well. And uh, I don't know. Uh, I can't help feel what I feel. I just do. I let go of somebody who didn't hurt my heart. And now he asked me to stay. And I don't like know what to do now. I just want someone to just want me as bad as I want them. And you tell me that you you have feelings still and that you've made mistakes and whatnot. And I like want to hear that and I want to believe that. But then I'm also like, is she just missing the what ifs? Like not the, not actually missing me. To say that there isn't a little bit of it that's what is, uh, what if, and confused would be a lie. Like, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I know, but to say that that's all that it is, is a lie. 
selfishly. Let's go catch a flight. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> I need to back to the girls. This was not supposed to happen this way. Okay. So, <laughs> I don't know. This is confusing to me. I wanted to kiss her, yes. That's what I was feeling. That's what I wanted to do. I mean, it wasn't that long ago, I know, that we broke up, so I guess it's just okay to feel this way. And I mean, I probably didn't handle this the right way today. I am trying to figure out what the hell my heart wants, and I don't know, I think I'm just like really scared that I'm not where I need to be right now for this. I don't know if I need to feel that love with someone else to fully move on. I don't know if I have to fully move on to feel that love with someone else. I don't know right now.